So, hi, my name is Ricardo Rivalda. I'm with Q Technology Denmark. We make industrial cameras. People know us because we are the potato uh, camera. Mm -hmm. uh, and yeah, we are collaborating in many parts of the uh, Linux layer, from the kernel to upstream. In the kernel, we are of course contributing to the media subsystem, but we also, uh, because our product is industrial, we are collaborating to the IIO, we are contributing to the GPIO and, and many, many other parts. Whenever we find something, we, we try to contribute it. And in user space, we are working with eStreamer, we are working, yeah, uh, Coreboot, we are working with you, uh, Coreboot, you would maybe not uh, user space, but yeah. Uh, those kind of things. Uh, Open CV also. In Paris today? In Paris today. So uh, now we are in the uh, candle uh, recipes. Before we were in the embedded recipes. It's great. It's a very nice conference, small family. It, it's great. We love it. Uh, um, what have you been working on lately yourself? What the last project you remember immediately that you enjoyed working on? So uh, for open, I mean for uh, open source uh, kernel, of course, that's the part I, I most enjoy with. And if we are looking into our applications now, we are working in uh, making industrial cameras for uh, hockey events, uh, recording from different areas, from different angles, uh, which is cool because we managed to see a lot of free hockey. Uh, we also are working. Uh, we still work, of course, with uh, the food industry. That's potatoes, that's carrots. Um, we're also looking into inspection of liquids. So last year we brought a demo of inspection of beer that we have been doing in collaboration with Carlsberg. And this year we plan to show a demo in Embedded World uh, and uh, ELC with uh, inspection of whiskey, looking for uh, plastic particles in liquids, which is a, it's a big thing now. Oh, wow. Perfect. That's awesome. In, in, in your talk this week, you were referring like how you guys can do like a lot of contribution to open source, uh, even though like you're like super small companies that like eight people in the team. Yeah. We, uh, can you talk like a little bit on, on how that's possible for your company or what's like some of the benefits you, you have by, by contributing most of the things you, you can like back to the community? So the most important thing for us will, is that uh, because we contribute a lot, we have less things to maintain. So we are a super small group. We need to be very careful of how we manage uh, our resources. So from those eight people that, that you were mentioning, uh, that, that's a whole company. Uh, that's the FPA group, uh, that's the mechanics, that's the PCB, that's management, that's the thing is even the person that prepares the food. So it's, it's uh, the software team, we are basically three people. And uh, if we didn't upstream our work, that will be uh, a lot of work to, to maintain. So thanks that we are contributing, we have less work to maintain. We are closer to the uh, community, so we can get our, uh, we can get best support from them. We can we, we can contact them through IRC mailing list, and then we get much more attention than we deserve for our size. So it's yeah. That's awesome. Thank you so, Thank so you. much.